America becomes the first nation dominated by the car. New types of businesses spring up for car users. Filling stations appear everywhere to fill thirsty cars. And drivers refuel in roadside diners. And the new mobility of people around the country has a vast effect on the economy. From the late 1930s onwards, car driving tourists across America spend $700 million a year on fizzy drinks, hot dogs, even golf. Today, golf is worth $84 billion to the U.S. economy alone. It's a sport that couldn't exist without the car, with so many courses in remote places. From just a few hundred golf courses in the U.S. in the 1910s, thanks to the automobile, there are now nearly 20,000. It doesn't take long for the car bug to spread.